not bad lah. Yeah. Quite wide lah. But I don't know whether distortion or not. And then anyway, they got the beautifying. Yeah, now, now the trend is actually the 0.5 times. I think, yeah. So got the wide angle. Any app to make you taller. Jaden, yeah. so let me explain to you what is this place. You know this place last time is World War II? Uh, sorry, this place is not World War II, but during World War II, uh, when Japanese invade uh, Singapore, we built cannons to face the sea yeah. to, to defend, uh, defend our country. Uh -huh. But at the end of the day, they didn't come from the sea. They came from Malaysia by walking. Which is crazy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, they use bicycle. <laughs> they use bicycle. <laughs> so yeah, we can come here and see the cannonball, which I think we have never used. Which was built by the British. Yeah. Yeah, quite important. Because I mean, it's a history of uh, Singapore. Yes. So where are we going, Shashan? We are going to a hidden trail here yeah. in Sentosa. Yeah, towards a hidden bridge. What hidden bridge? Hidden bridge. Uh, you thought you'll find out. <laughs> really? <laughs> How do you actually find this place? Uh, I was tracking for one of my oh, my shoes. Uh, last time, yeah. Uh, so basically, I did not bring any selfie stick or anything like that. It's just the camera itself because it's not like I don't want to bring anything or feel that it's a hassle to bring a selfie stick or an additional mic or something like that. Just because. I feel the camera is convenient enough to not bring anything. So yeah, apart from using all the mirrorless cameras for vlogs, I think this is a lot more lighter, a lot more smaller. Uh, I've yet to test out the audio quality, so maybe you guys can judge from it. We have reached uh, at the start of the season 4 already. Right really? And? Actually, actually maybe, I think maybe not so hidden. Uh. I see some. Some people are already are here already. <laughs> yeah, well, it's not very hidden. Uh. People are running here, people are walking here, see so many people in front. But actually, apparently, uh, I think a lot of Singaporeans don't know about this. Yeah, so, okay. you so once you watch this video, you will be able to know about this place. Some of you might know, some of you might not know, but yeah. So follow us on our journey on this hidden place here in Sentosa, where Sean brought us. He says it is a hidden place <laughs> la. But yeah. I don't see it very well hidden in Sentosa. No, like maybe it's because maybe uh, it's the end of the Sentosa, so maybe it might be inconvenient for some of you. But it's, uh, it's quite nice, like, you can see the, the Singapore skyline, especially the, the reflections at Sentosa, eh? uh, at, at Marina Central Bay. Uh, I can see the. Oh, now, currently now it's low tide, so we. Yeah, able to see the beach. Oh, so can we go down to the beach or what? Yeah, sure. It's hidden enough for us to go down where yeah. there is no security. Yeah. But yeah, so a bit about this place, uh, how to come to this place. So you just need to find Shangri-La and then you can go to the South Point uh, parking lot. Or I, I, I'm not too sure about the tram. Uh, maybe you can take a tram here all the way to South Point, which there is a Sentosa that keeps you zen from partying too much, but yeah. Yeah, quite a lot of picture, uh, pictures for over here. You can see the, the plants, the sea, I think. Yeah, I think it should be a yeah. quite nice place for photographers. Yeah. That maybe you want to bring some models here yeah. to take some pictures. So we had the opportunity because Sean says it's low tide and this is a entry point that you can go in into the hidden beach, so let's try. Have to seal down. <laughs> huh? Have to have seal down? <laughs> yeah. Ah, I think uh, you can. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I think it's okay. It's fine for me. I'm quite good in my balancing. 
but yeah. This is a hidden private beach whereby there's not much people. So maybe it's more secluded. You know, they have a nice big tree here that you can see. Great view. You can see reflections. Over there is Harbourfront, that's PSA. Well, I go on to the normal Sentosa public beach. Huh? I don't see a lot of seashells. But this seashell is like, wow. Well, quite a lot, eh? you can see. There's quite a lot of these. And there are a lot of dead corals. But yeah, because it's, as I said, low tide again. So, yeah. Lucky, God was forgiving today. Uh, the weather is actually pretty nice. Uh, we are here at about 8.30 in the morning. So, yeah, it's actually quite a nice place. Actually, this place reminds me of Pula Ubin. Always, you know, when it's low tide, you know, you'll be able to see a lot of uh, life forms on the low tide. And you know, you get to see all the stuff and all the, yeah, as you can see here, we have, yeah, this is probably because of low tide, that's why. So I'm not too sure about how the image stabilization is. So basically, I'm not too sure on how the IS will work, the image stabilization. Uh, but yeah, we will go back and review the footage and see whether if there is any jerkiness. Uh, but of course, definitely the wide angle helps with the image stabilization. Image stabilization for sure. Yeah, I, I do have some pronunciation problem, so. I do apologize for that. But yeah, the weather is really nice and cool. We have other people here. I'm not sure whether was it they follow us or what, but yeah. But yeah, we are going on to... Where are we going now? Skywalk? Yeah. Alright, we're going to Skywalk. Let's go! Let's go.